Hello Balmy Badrami, welcome to today's show, I hope you're alright guys. Today we're going to be doing Halloween Tongue Painter Sweets from Lidl. Hopefully these aren't as gross as the previous ones that we tried before. That garlic flavour really, really made me sick. I'm not even joking, it really, really made me sick, it was absolutely gross. But yet these are Tongue Painter Sweets, so delve in. Here we go. Oh, okay. Uh, that's an interesting smell. Um, I'm not too sure if I like the smell, to be honest with you. It smells very chemically. Mmm. Not going to like this, I don't think. Uh, something about it is going to scare me off, I think. I love the design of these, you know, with the skeletons and the pumpkin patch and all that sort of stuff. And of course the scary black cat and all that sort of stuff. So let's see what they actually taste like. Not too sure. <laughs> so the tongue painting works that's great i must admit when you first start eating the sweet it really doesn't taste that nice but you have to give it a bit more of a go like it's like a really old school traditional hard boiled sweet you know it takes you ages to get to the flavor <laughs> the tongue painting aspect looks fantastic, but the flavours aren't quite there for me. It's not something I would have more than one or two of. I'm not that keen. I don't know, there's just something about it where it just doesn't taste quite right. It's true. There's something about the black currant one that really didn't float my boat there. That wasn't actually that nice. It was all right, but it wasn't that nice. There's no way of telling which flavor's which. So I'll we'll try another one and hopefully we get more than just the black currant. But it does work. The tongue painting aspect of it does work. But so far the flavor I'm not keen on. Maybe I wasn't meant to have that one. Let's try a different one. I bet this one is definitely a black currant one. Okay, come on. What's going on here? Right. It's like a fake orangey taste. Oh. Mm. I know in the previous ones they were definitely going for gross flavours, but it doesn't actually say that on here it says fruity. <laughs> and it doesn't actually say they're going to be sour or anything. That was actually quite sour. I'm not too keen on these. This is the first negative review I've done since a long time. I think it was something to do with like the, the gumball sweets and stuff like that. It was the last one. But yeah, I wasn't very too... I'm not very keen on these. Sorry, Lidl. There's no word of it being a sour flavour. It says fruity. 
the tongue painting works, but they're not very desirable sweets. You know, I wouldn't go back and have loads. And I don't even know if Badger Junior would like them. I'm not too keen on these. Four out of ten. Mm. Sorry, little. Back to the drawing board ready for next year, matey. <coughs> not very keen on these at all. Hopefully they will be able to do a bit better next time. Fingers crossed. But not my favourites there. Let me know if you enjoy these and why you think I should change my opinion. Please do. Because I'd love to hear your positive reactions to these and what your thoughts are and if you actually enjoyed them or not. Hit me up in the comments. Thanks very much for watching, guys. And let me know your thoughts on today's vlog and if you enjoyed it or not. And what are you guys getting up to for Halloween? Comment below. Thanks very much for watching and I'll see you soon. Bye!